Yeah. Jim, if you could just start off talking about your sort of experience with dealing with the women's team so far this season. Yeah, so Chester FC Community Trust is responsible um, for the development of the women's team and of the uh, wider women's and girls uh, game. Um, so through Steph Oscroft and Dean Vian, um, we support the women's team to make sure they've got everything they need to be as competitive as possible when they're on the field. Um, and then underpinning that, we have the under 18s team, um, which will hopefully, hopefully produce players of the future. Um, and then underneath that, we have the Girls Development Centre, um, which we run in partnership with Cheshire Football Association, um, which is working with the local community clubs and providing players who are recognised having the potential um, to progress in the women's game with the elite environment and top quality professional coaching to hopefully realise that potential. And what, what are we looking at for the future? There's been discussions of, of maybe the women's team playing at the ground. What, what do you make of that? Yeah, so I think for the, for the women's team, it's about sustainable growth uh, and sustainable success um, and making sure that whatever happens, that there are really solid foundations to ensure that women's football um, in Chester and, uh, and under the Chester FC banner can continue to grow and prosper. Um, so in the, in the sort of immediate aims, um, they've done really well this season and um, been really competitive in the Cheshire and Women's League. Uh, and the aim is to go for promotion, um, which will put them into the, the North West Counties League. Um, but we recognise that we've got quite a few steps to make before we can sort of really challenge at the, the top level of, of women's football. Um, could they ever play at the stadium? I, I don't see why not. Um, women's football, on the back of the Lions' success in the World Cup, um, is, on a, is on a high and it seems to be growing all the time in popularity and participation. Um, and I, I'd really like to think that Chester FC can be at the forefront of that development moving forwards.